Hey, it's Patrick from JMP Cycles, and I'm going to show you how to test the battery on your motorcycle. And why would you want to do that? Well, if you're having a hard starting problem or your battery keeps going dead, the battery is the first place you're going to want to start before you move on to other things in your charging system. You may have a charging system problem or something of that nature, but you definitely want to start with the battery first, because honestly, that's probably going to be your easiest fix. It's a really easy process. All you're going to need is a little multimeter and to find the battery location on your motorcycle. On this particular Evo Sportster, battery is really easy to access. Took the seat off so I can get to the ground right here. I have my multimeter. You're gonna wanna set your multimeter to 12 volts. You do not want your bike on for this. The bike needs to be off. And then we wanna put the red side on the positive of the battery and the black side on the negative. And this is saying we have 13 volts. That's a really good battery. What you're gonna look for is anywhere between 12 to say 13, 13 and a half volts. That's a good hot battery. What does it mean to have a bad battery? If it's under 12 volts, really under 12 and a half even, you could have a problem with your battery. Now, to know if you have that problem, I say throw a trickle charger on the battery, let it charge up, do not ride the motorcycle, check it again in a few minutes, it shouldn't take long, throw that voltmeter on there and after you charge it above 12 volts, if it drops back down below 12 again, then you have a bad battery. If it stays above the 12 volts after you charge it, well then you probably have uh, something wrong with your charging system somewhere else on the bike. We do have videos to help you out with that. I'll throw some links in there for you guys. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop us a comment. Go work on those motorcycles.